back. It is Thursday, which means it's time for our weekly imagination station segment. One of the funnest times of the week. Amy Cress is here today and we're going to have a little bit of fun with uh, what people may start seeing in their Easter baskets coming up here and also a few other items. Amy, what do you have yeah, for us this exactly. morning? Exactly. We've got some Easter bunny peeps right here um, and we've got lots of other stuff. And what we have over here is a vacuum chamber. Now, I'm interested and intrigued <laughs> as usual. So the idea here is we're going to supersize some of these items. Yeah, exactly. We're going to put each one of them in our vacuum chamber here and see what happens. Okay. So our vacuum chamber, let's go ahead and start with the balloon here. All righty. Okay, Can I so help out with this one then too? Oh, that's a... You there vacuum, we go. You've, I you've vacuumed vacuum it. sealed it already. <laughs> we know it works. All right. So go ahead and put the balloon right in the center there. Okay. Bernardo, our friend. Bernardo. Oh. <laughs> Bernardo, you fell over. Right. Okay. okay, so a balloon has equal atmospheric pressure on the inside and the outside of it. So what our vacuum chamber is going to do is going to pull out the pressure from the outside of it. Okay. So the pressure on the inside is going to start expanding and pushing outward. All right. So our friend Bernardo. So you are gonna... you are not blowing up the balloon here. You're evacuating some of the pressure inside here, so it's allowing the balloon to expand. Exactly. So there's no more pressure pushing down on it from the outside anymore. So it's causing it to expand. All right, and it's going to keep getting bigger and bigger there. I have All a right, feeling I know cool. where this one's going. <laughs> well, it's not going to pop. Really? Yeah. It's just going to. You sure? I'm. I'm. Pretty Fairly, confident. <laughs> yeah. It's going to actually seal down the valve down wow. here, and we're going to let it go and see what happens. So let's try okay. it. <laughs> okay. So as we let it go, it. Bernardo went back to his original size <laughs> there, so that's good. So why don't we go ahead and try one of our peeps here? Now I know why you wouldn't let me go inside the vacuum. <laughs> that probably wouldn't be a good idea. I don't think I'd go back to my original size. All right. All right. <laughs> So we'll try our peep now. Okay, so our balloon, picture that as one pocket of air, right? Okay. So our peep here is going to signify about a million pockets of air. Okay. So we've got a little million tiny balloons in our peep here and in our marshmallow. <laughs> and as it's going, we can kind of compare it to this one over here. Uh-huh. So it's gonna go, remember, we're removing the pressure from the outside and the, all the little tiny balloons on the inside are expanding and expanding. You want, your, you want your candy <laughs> supersized this Easter. This is the way to do it. That would be awesome if we had ju jumbo peeps like this, right? Yes. Okay. He's getting a little it's bit bigger. Huge. Yeah, he's probably almost doubled or tripled in size. Yeah, compared, okay. Compared to the other one. So let's go ahead and remove this, let the air back in. <laughs> he sounded <laughs> sad. He did. So as we, yeah, he's all wrinkled now as we let the air back in. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it, it did it, kind of change shape yeah. a little bit. So we've got one more thing, the shaving cream. Okay. How about you go ahead and fill the cup up to the brim right there with our shaving okay. cream. Okay, so shaving cream has a whole lot more air in it, right? So it's gonna be about a trillion of okay. these air pockets. Is that's that good. good. Yeah, All right. That's perfect. Okay, so we're gonna it's put this right in here. making me think about ice cream. <laughs> well, nice, it could look day. like it, you never know. All right, so. All right, we're looking for big and better things here, aren't we? Yeah, we are. So right away it starts expanding, it those does. trillions of balloons inside. All right, All right, so uh, explain a little science to me too about what's going on with this. Well, um, we have atmospheric pressure pressing down on everything, right? Mm -hmm. It's 14.7 pounds per square inch. Okay. So as the vacuum removes that air and the air pressure from the outside, um, our shaving cream there is able to expand. Okay. So it's going to keep expanding. Do you think we have time to let it go a little oh, bit longer? Oh yeah, let's let this one run here. It's it's just starting it's, to get it's just starting to get moving right now. It's going to keep going. It kind of does look like ice cream, doesn't it? It does. All right, so very good. So it's all about that unbalanced pressure, right? The unbalanced pressure from the outside and the pressure from the inside is pushing out. So how far is this one going to go for us too? If we let this vacuum kind of run and run and run, what is the maximum extent with this? I mean, I would I thought the peep was going to explode. What we have shaving cream here. Is there endless possibilities with this? Right. Well, the peeps in the balloon get to kind of a point where they stop expanding, but our shaving cream can fill up this entire thing. It's going to keep going and going. As you can see, it's getting really really big right now. And I'm it will it. completely take the shape and fill up this container. It will. So we've got like trillions of those balloons in there, remember, and they're expanding from the Very reduced cool. pressure on the outside. And it keeps, as you can see, I it's like pressing that. against well, the sides Well, as there. that's filling up, I just want to remind people that Mindbender Mansion at the Imagination Station is going to be going on through April, so people can check that out. Learn about a bunch of fun science experiments about yep. peeps, and there we go. Exactly. We've, about, we've about filled this entire Bottle up. Right. Should we let it go again? Up. Sure. Okay. Why not? This is really fun. All righty. <laughs> <laughs> so all of our air is let out. 
let back in actually, yeah. and we get this kind of liquidy substance. No more fluffiness to our shaving cream anymore. Need to shave. <laughs> All right, Amy, thanks so much. Appreciate you stopping by for another fun and exciting science experiment. Now, coming up next from us, a couple.